Hello, good day to you. I'm Bill B. Trung. I'm on behalf of everyone. This is an open letter video to Dispatch Games. Now before I start, I'm not cancelling anyone. You're asking for the head of the man and or woman in charge of this company. All that I and those you've left hanging for two or so years ask is to do better. You've burned the bridge and now it is time to rebuild. it. Let's start with what made me make this video. The cloning around your company has pulled since 2019 or earlier. We know you have a partnership with the company known as City Connection, his spiritual successor and estate run by former employees of Jaleco. At first, you did City Connection some decent distribution, but come 2018, you have become a clone of Nicholas, but much worse. Basically, you keep announcing titles and then after the people give you money for the games at your store, you ghost them for months on end, followed by excuses and empty and fake promises. It was your doing as to why you keep getting hostile and vitriolic comments on your social media. You left them in the dark for so long that they got the idea that you took the money and run while leaving the people that paid you for those games in the dark. It is a miracle that City Connection didn't shank your nuts out and sell them on eBay and then release you from the partnership that you and you alone so during all this. Huh, let's talk on how you can improve the company. Please note. We are not asking for any foolish work quotas, only real, honest fucking guide improvements. Let's start with the elephant in the room, transparency, of which you shall no excuse of a company lacks. Before you make any more excuses, we get it. The pandemic in 2020 was hard on you but it was harder on those you have left hanging. Most of your customers by that point are either stranded at home or unemployed. But you left them with a false glimmer of hope and then fuck off, off for a few months. And to make matters worse for yourself, months ago on Instagram you rubbed the games in the faces of your customers that waited to fucking years four. And now you solidly shipped out the games and scorched it. Your Instagram feed is this all you can do, I think now. How about you start with apologizing to your customers and by apologize, I mean a real honest to fucking God apology. After that, apologize sincerely to City Connection for screwing them over too. After the apology tour, this time you announce games. Be more honest and transparent about them to your customers for fuck's sake. And by transparent. I mean make sure that the release dates are concrete, not rug pulling bullshit once and keep them up to date on new games and other things to build. And now for social media. Once again Dispatch, it is your fault that you keep getting vitriolic comments on both Facebook and Instagram for your blistering bullshit deeds against your customers. And for you to sign those are justifiably pissed at you in favor of your ass-kissing influencers is trashy, disgusting and disheartening at best. Couldn't be more understanding and open about your products to your customers next time, but there's some peer people that relate to them in a legit fashion or some things. Cause tears in your social media and put in your justifiably pissed Customers on waitlist isn't gonna fix anything! I mean letting your customers wait for two fucking years for their games, especially when one of them namely game parodies is already on the Switch. The shop is borderline fucking stupid, don't you think? In closing, Dispatch, quit being a dingus and be more open and transparent towards your customers next time. Remember, Dispatch, lying and ghosting is wrong. Be more transparent or you will go bankrupt and you have yourselves to blame. Bill be Tron out. Peace and love. Peace and love.